pants. Pants are good. Hello, are you packing for your trip? I am. I need a skirt for rehearsal. Sexy mini skirt. For the last two and a half months, I have been the first little person to ever compete on Dancing with the Stars. Sarah and Sasha. I didn't see a little person, I saw a huge star. Oh, you're small in stature, but you're big in heart. Tara, you light my fire. It feels amazing to be part of the top five, but working 12 to 14 hour days has been consuming my entire life. And now Joe is going on tour with his band and I'm just really trying to stay above water right now. It's just gonna be difficult not having you around. You haven't been around for two and a half months. That's different though. How's I come home at night and I'm so, here in the morning. The babies, You're actually like the babies not are here. asleep. You come home, you go to sleep, then you wake up at about 5 a.m., they're still asleep. Then you go, hey, here's the babies, and then you go, bye. And honest to God, like, it feels good to get out of here for a little bit. Don't you feel like that's selfish? You're out of here every day. I'm being honest, like, it's, it's freaking stressful here. I'm glad to, like, get some me time. You get me time all the time. You always go out with your boys. And meanwhile, all I'm doing is working and then coming home. That's it. You're a big superstar, so that's what you have I'm to do. I'm not a superstar. Yeah, you are. It's a compliment. The last thing that I want right now is for us to be arguing because on top of everything else, the thing that scares me the most is now I have two hernias. Oh my God. I was told I couldn't do any strenuous activity until six weeks after my C-section. But I started Dancing with the Stars three weeks after my C-section. So what has happened is my abdominal wall has not been strong enough to heal properly. And now I can see two hernias protruding through my abdominal wall. This is one right here. Let me see your finger. So this is the first one, and then this is the second one. And it's a tear in your stomach. And my intestines pushing through. That sounds safe. The only thing that worries me is the fact that I've gotten more than one. And so that means that I'm like really putting stress on my body. I know you're pretty strong headed. I wouldn't doubt if you didn't do what the doctor said. What if you permanently injure yourself? Like, How am I gonna permanently hurt myself? What if but internally? Like, okay, well, if I have good. extreme pain, then I would be rushed off to the doctor. You wanna wait till that moment happens where you have extreme pain? Yeah. When you put the six of us in a room, you can't expect every moment to be drama free. It's perfect if you wanna look like the 40 year old virgin. I've had enough. You've got to be kidding me.